Yerp, what is good, J.I. Squad, and welcome back to it again, another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys. Now, in today's video, as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we do have a new mod for Vader. Dig what I'm saying? So more carbon fiber. Y'all already know me, man. I love carbon. So we're just going to keep on throwing as many carbon fiber pieces on this car as we can until we can't no more. Legit. So that being said, let's go ahead and roll this intro and get straight into this banger video, man. I'm super stoked to see how the car looks with this new piece of carbon. Yeah, what's up, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it. We ain't with the sub and in the cut with it. Please, none of the talks, I heard enough of it. Like, what you gonna do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this, don't talk about it. Really on the move, on the map, never slip. Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it. Real eyes, real lies, real lies. All the time, stand on it. If we said it, we don't walk around it. Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips, new phone, who this? No, we don't allow it. Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, came from. Sheesh. Yes, sir. She already know carbon hood, carbon side skirts, carbon antenna, carbon trunk. Sheesh. Carbon gas door, and then whole interior covered in carbon door handles on the interior and whatnot. And so the next piece of carbon, you may ask J.I., what is it going to be? Well, it's in that box right there. So let's go ahead and get it going. OK, so boom, y'all already know how this goes, man. We unbox carbon on more carbon. You dig? So I'm going to go ahead and pop this box open. Get them sides going. Sheesh. Y'all already know next gen speed for the win, man, if you need anything carbon fiber man tap in with the guys no bap y'all go show my boys some love and make sure you use the promo code right here at the bottom of your screen for anything carbon so obviously you know got the alcohol wipes definitely gonna help apply that you know what i'm saying and then y'all guys can see for real through the little foam covering we got doing this one-handed man y'all go ahead spam that like button for the kid right now just for the fact i'm doing this one-handed bingo get one of them out straight like that Ooh -wee. shout out my boys atrd with the ooh wee man but golly look at that carbon and then y'all already know comparison gotta do a weave check gotta do that weave check man sheesh that carbon hitting is that carbon hitting hitting or is it hitting though that bit hitting hitting yummy and you got to do the back of that joint see the weave on the back so this joint ain't fake genuine carbon fiber and then you got the little end pieces for the hard copy key you know what i'm saying sheesh can we do a weave check please oh my goodness i think i might do a little b-roll sheesh yes sir man so installation on this should be very very relatively simple all you're gonna do is clean each door handle make sure you wipe it down my car is completely dirty as you guys can see i'm actually washing it tonight um but you're gonna make sure that the surface is completely clean just like any other piece of carbon and you're gonna take your alcohol wipe and just wipe it down real quick and then you'll take the overlay place it on there and just hold it in place that's literally it so i'm gonna go ahead and get started so this is the before, now here's the after. Sheesh, this is the after, boy. Oh my God. That joint looks so crazy. It's such a small item, but it makes such a big difference. And then show y'all clearance, no rubbing, button still works. That's locked, unlocked. Yeah, man, we like that, locked, yeah. Sheesh, big carbon. So now we're about to go ahead and do the passenger side, and that's it. One hour later. 
All right, y'all, so as y'all can see, we are back in the J-I-H-Q right now as we can speak, as we speak, you did. That's what I meant to say, not as we can speak, as we speak, we are in the J-I-H-Q. Got Vader right here, all dirty and whatnot. I do need to clean him, but I did want to go ahead and touch on a couple things real quick with the door handles. Something for you guys to look forward to and pay attention to uh, when you get these door handles is the simple fact that, you know what? I'm gonna just flip the camera over and I'll show you. All right, y'all, so this is most definitely one of those, like, I can show you better than I can tell you situations. The cutout for the button on the door handle itself, let me see if I can get the iPhone to focus. Okay, y'all can kind of see it's like the cutout for the button is almost a hair too small. So the button is kind of like flush in the door handle. So like you kind of don't really feel the button pop back out into place. Then also the spacing on where the carbon meets the door is different. So this is the passenger side. And now this is the driver's side. There's no gap there. So literally, and then again, same issue with the button. It's just a tad too small. So it's like flush now. But other than that, man, I love the carbon fiber. I think that it came out great. It looks amazing with the rest of the pieces of carbon. You guys saw the weave check. Um, the weave on the carbon is great. Next Gen Speed is always dope about their quality with these carbon fiber pieces, man. I haven't got any of the hydro dip stuff because as you guys know, I really like the genuine carbon fiber. I mean, y'all see my car, man, you know, carbon fiber poppy is what they should call me, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, um, legit, every single piece has to have an even form of weave. Like the weave has to be straight. There can't be any like blemishes or like blurs or stuff like that. Cause it just throw, it messes with my OCD and like, I can't lie, I hate it. But looking at the carbon, man, it flows. It looks just like the Anderson Composites carbon. Next Gen Speed, again, huge shout out to you guys, man. If you guys are in the market for carbon fiber for your Mopar, your GM products, man, make sure you go check out my guys over at Next Gen Speed. Their shipping is great. Their quality of the products is great. And I'm not gonna lie, their inventory just continues to grow. My boys over there are working. They're working hard, and I am actually working with them to get the, the inlets for the tri-bar spoiler for the 1LE. I'm trying to get those made in carbon, as you guys seen in the most recent video. I took the little fins off, but I'm also going to have them do the dive planes from Drake Muscle, and I should have showed y'all this while I was right here the rear diffuser splat all in carbon fiber so y'all stay tuned for that because i know it's gonna complete the look of the rear end once i get the carbon diffuser have the carbon splat with the carbon winglet right here because like in my personal opinion bro it looks naked like it did expose this body line in this area right here it did expose that not having that there anymore but i don't know Maybe because, you know, it's a 1LE and there was always something there. Now that there's nothing there, it's kind of messing with me. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. When we get the carbon feast back and we put it on, if it doesn't look right, you know, I can always take it off. And then, you know, maybe just get something, I don't know, down the line to kind of like make up for, for that gap, fill that void. But uh, yeah, man. With all that being said, I am starting to sweat. It is stupid hot out here in Houston, man. If you are new to the channel, do your boy a favor. Hit that subscribe button and join DJI Squad. Turn on your post notifications to give this video a big thumbs up if you like the carbon fiber and where this build is going. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. What piece should I do next? Do I do the mirrors or do I do the front lip? Y'all let me know. I'm gonna let y'all decide. So carbon fiber mirrors or carbon fiber front splitter. Y'all let me know in the comment section down below. I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. Let's go ahead and roll that outro. Peace.